earthquake. There are three layers of the earth. Crust, mantle, and core. Crust. It is the earth's surface that made up of several large and small plates. Mantle. It is the widest layer of the earth and it is made up of magma. Core. It is the inner layer of the earth and it is composed of liquid layer, outer core, and solid layer, inner core. Earthquake. It is the sudden shaking of the earth's surface. There are two types of earthquakes. Volcanic earthquake and tectonic earthquake. Volcanic earthquake. This type of earthquake happens with a strong volcanic eruption. Tectonic earthquake. This type of earthquake is caused by the movement of the Earth's crust. It happens when a crustal plates move. As these plates move, some parts of the Earth's crust are pushed toward each other or away from each other. Their movement causes nearby rocks to move as well. Thus, the rocks break and slide past each other. When rocks break, waves of energy are released and sent out through the Earth. These waves trigger an earthquake. Fault is any crack or fracture that divides two rocky blocks move in opposite directions. It is formed when rocks on the crust are compressed or stretched due to the movement of plates. There are three types of faults. The deep slip, the strike slip, and the oblique. Deep slip. It is when hanging wall and foot wall move vertically along the fault line. Strike slip. It is when the hanging wall and the foot wall move horizontally. Oblique. It is a combined motion of horizontal and vertical movements. Focus and epicenter. Focus. It is the point in the crust where the breaking or shaking originates. This is also the point where the first wave of seismic energy released. Epicenter. It is the ground directly above the focus. Seismograph. It is the instrument used to measure the motion of the ground during an earthquake. Seismologist. It is the scientist who studies earthquakes. Magnitude and intensity. Magnitude. It refers to the amount of energy released by an earthquake from its focus. In measuring the magnitude of an earthquake, we use the Richter magnitude scale developed by Charles F. Richter. Intensity It refers to the effects of earthquakes as shown in the destruction of buildings, crops, and number of casualties. In the Philippines, we use the PVOX Earthquake Intensity Scale in measuring the earthquake's intensity. PVOX, Philippine Institute of Volcanology and Seismology. It is an institution responsible in providing information on the activities of volcanoes, earthquakes, and tsunamis. PVOX Earthquake Intensity Scale. Did you know that the Philippines often experiences earthquakes? 
This is because the country is located in the circum-Pacific belt or known as the Pacific Ring of Fire where the crustal plates are weak and causes movements of plates that causes earthquakes.